The Davy County Republican says he supports President Trump's decision to bomb Syria, but says he doesn't give the president carte blanche when it comes to military intervention. I think it was a right decision. Congressman Bud tells students at a middle school in Statesville why he supports the president's decision. And we needed to stop uh, the atrocities. And so there was human rights interest and there was national interest. And it, real, it made the world once again realize that America is strong. And it showed the president, it showed the world that our president is very serious about this. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering what you think, though, that the country gets out of what the president has done with the bombing of Syria. What, what, sure. what, is, what is the upside of this? We are, uh, we are a country that loves a people. We love, our, we love people in this country. We love people in other countries. We care. And so this demonstrated that atrocities will not be tolerated. And so I think that was one of the best things that President Trump could have done. He said, yes, we're strong, and yet we care um, about people in other countries, and we're not going to tolerate atrocities in dictatorships like uh, like Assad's. And are you comfortable with the president not seeking approval from Congress? Uh, for a first strike, yes. As this, if this becomes prolonged, uh, if this does, then we'll have to seek uh, congressional approval for this and work on a plan going forward. Define that for me, because I mean, there could be another quick strike. It could be North Korea next. We don't know. Sure. We'll have to work uh, between the president, the State Department, and Congress to see as much diplomacy as, and ex exert as much pressure as we can. Uh, from other nations, but if this, if there are boots on the ground, uh, we need congressional approval for this. Is that the crucial part for you, whether or not there are boots on the ground, determining if the president has to come to Congress? I, I think that's that is definitely for sure, if there are boots on the ground, but let's get Congress involved as early as possible. If you have a question about Syria, health care, or anything else, Congressman Ted Budd says he will meet with his constituents this Friday in Greensboro. In Winston-Salem, I'm Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News.